Hello, everybody. Hi, how are you today? Hello, teacher. Hey, Hi. how are you? Hello, Carlos. Hello. Hello, teacher. Hello. Hello. Good evening, Good evening. teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, Elsa, welcome teacher. back. Jessica, Carolina, welcome. Very good. Reloaded, right? In Spanish, you said recargados. Congratulations. To, congratulations to continue, right? And welcome to the new student, right? Mateo. We have also, let me see, Moises. Welcome, Moises, to the class, right? Hello. Thanks, Hello. Teacher. It's a pleasure. It's a pleasure. Welcome. Welcome. Okay. My name is Javier Gomez, right? Javier Gomez. And um, I will be your teacher, right? I will be your teacher in this class okay very good let me check something here okay and i will i will share a material to you i will share a material just give me a second here right i have a message okay uh, jessica carolina i understand jessica no problem Jessica Carolina, okay. Good. Now let's begin, right? I will share the PowerPoint presentation. Okay, before we start. Okay, class. Welcome to basic, no, not basic number one. Nah, excuse me. It's basic number two, right? Or beginner, if you want to say beginner two, right? Beginner two. Yes. Again, yes. Welcome to beginner number two. Uh, we are going to have classes from August 21st, today, Monday, to September. Dun, 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 September, right? September 18th, we finish the, this course in September 18th, right? Good, this is my name, Javier Gomez, right? I am a teacher, an English teacher, right? And, and uh, I also a, a lawyer, a lawyer, right? And I have received some some training, some training, okay. Welcome, Maria Rene. Give me a second. I will copy here. Maria Rene. Okay, listen. Good. So I have received a didáctica para la planificación del idioma inglés. It means support, right? And also a course from the Cambridge University, uh, preparing a student for international communication. And also I received this training in ITCA, Instituto Tecnológico Centroamericano en Santa Tecla how to develop your own teaching material, right? And I work in many places, right? Especially in Regal International, that is English Corporativo, right? MINED, Ministerio de Educación, ITCA, GMC International Business School, Capucón, UCA, Colegio Santenés, Colegio de la Matepe, Colegio San Francisco, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, right? Many places. So it's a pleasure to be your teacher. It's a pleasure to stay here with you. And now we're going to, to check it out, the rules for this class, right? The rules. Okay, let me see. René Alexi, estaré oyente porque está lloviendo. Okay, it's raining. Okay, Alexi. Let me check. Mm -hmm. I can find René Alexi. Uh, ah, here, right? René Alexi. Caballero, Amasha. Okay, thank you. And Carlos Francisco. Oh, yes. Oyente, too. Oyente, right? Okay. Carlos Francisco. Good. Let's continue. So it says, I, I, I will say in Spanish, because this is in Spanish, right? 
es necesario obtener el 80% de la asistencia, right? En, y las tareas y evaluaciones, right? So, la nota mínima, you say in Spanish, right? Is 8, 8, right? Ok. Now, eh, las tareas se encuentran en la plataforma. Ya vamos a observar la plataforma, right? Justo después de cada clase. Good. Todas las tareas de los temas ya cubiertos tienen que estar completas antes de cada viernes. Ok, so for example, this Friday, we have to complete unit one, right? Para este viernes ya tenemos que haber completado la unidad uno. Ok, good. Now, let's continue, says, antes de cada, a la medianoche, uh, medianoche, right? Ya que en ese registro es enviado por Insafor semanalmente. Yes, good. La fecha límite uh, para terminar el examen midterm, examen de medio curso, va a ser el día viernes primero de septiembre. ¿Ok? Ese día ya tenemos que tener listo el examen de medio curso, el midterm examen. Y la fecha límite para terminar el examen final va a ser el día lunes 18, el último. El último día de clase ya tienen que tener terminado, antes de la clase. ¿Ok? Sería el viernes 11. No, no, no. No, perdón. No, no es viernes 11. Le, le me dice, viernes 15. Bueno, el día de la independencia. <ríe> Tienen que tener listo ya el, el, el examen final. El manual puede ser descargado de la plataforma. Ya les voy a enseñar cómo hacerlo. Y no se utiliza otro material más que el, los que el teacher comparte. ¿Ok? Oh, sorry, any question? ¿Hay alguna pregunta sobre esto? Evaluaciones y asistencia al 80%. El día viernes primero de septiembre vamos a hacer el examen de medio curso. Pero si quieren hacerlo antes, no hay problema, mejor. Y el examen final debe estar completado ya para la última clase, el lunes 18 de septiembre. ¿Ok? Yo. ¿No questions? No questions. Thank you very much, Moisés. Thank you. Now, requerimientos. Nombre completo al conectarse. Este ha sido un requisito indispensable, ¿verdad? Tenemos a William Antonio Vázquez Amaya. Excelente, William. Nombre completo. Ok, quiero ver quién más. Evelyn Janet Fuentes, correct. Creo que todos estamos con el nombre completo, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Let me check. Ah, Moisés, please. Si puede co copiarme todo su nombre completo, Moisés, please. Ok. This please. Moment. Ok, good. Thank you. Luego dice, eh, en el caso de oyente, se agregará la palabra oyente. Ok, así es que por algún motivo, viaje, tráfico, accidente, o están en la casa de un vecino, pues, y desde ahí reciben la clase y no pueden participar, pues, me van a poner oyente. Ok. Cámara encendida todo el tiempo. Vamos a ver quién es. Tiene la cámara encendida. William, Delia, Ingrid, Carlos Armando. Solamente. Ok, please. Encendamos nuestras cámaras, chicos. Recuerden que es un requisito de Insafor. Yes, thank you, Erenia. Thank you, Moisés. Very good. I have more messages. He says, buenas noches, teacher. Ingrid, right? Voy en el tráfico. Ah, oh, sorry. Sorry, Ingrid. The traffic in los chorros, especially because it's raining. La voy a poner de oyente, Ingrid. Yes. Raining in los chorros. Ooh. It's a chaos. It's a chaos, right? Okay, let's continue. Minimizar el sonido ambiente. Okay, so for that reason, yes, he... Ahí su hermano, su tío, su papi está escuchando rancheras a todo volumen. Por favor, pedirle que le baje un poquito el volumen. <ríe> ok. En participación activa. I like the participation a lot. Me fascina la participación. Así que ahí voy a estar preguntándoles toda la clase. Ok. Good. Let's continue. Asistencia al 100%. Ok, no hay permisos. 
La asistencia no solamente se toma al estar presente, sino también al cumplir con la clase completa. Si el teacher les dice que participen, no estén durmiendo. Hay que ponerse activo, ¿ok? Like this. La asistencia se toma en tres ocasiones, a las ocho. Hoy por ser el primer día, lo, lo voy a tomar un poquito tarde, pero normalmente entre ocho y ocho diez tomo la, la asistencia. Luego a las nueve y luego cinco minutos antes de terminar la clase. Solo pueden decir present, o here I am, o, o presente en Spanish, right? O aquí estoy, o, o vive la alianza. No, no, aunque okay. yeah. cualquier expresión que indique que están ahí presentes, ¿ok? Good. Y tener siempre la cámara encendida, right? Eh, en el caso de Jessica Carolina, ya me explicó, pues, que no puede tener la cámara encendida ahorita, ¿verdad? Pero los demás, Ingrid también, ¿verdad? Y pues... Carlos Armando, sí, me imagino, ¿verdad? María del Carmen, Brenda, Elizabeth, ok, ah, Carlos Francisco está de oyente, ya vimos, ¿verdad? Y todos los demás que no estén de oyentes, pues sí, cámara encendida todo el tiempo, ¿verdad? Ok, uh, y si tiene algún problema con la cámara, pues mándeme un mensaje y yo voy a entender cuál es el problema, pero tendría que ser solo de emergencia, ok. Sesiones uno a uno disponibles. Cada participante será asignado 10 minutos al finalizar cada clase para aclarar dudas con su facilitador. Entrevista personal, 10 minutos, 10 minutos. Ok. Eh, como somos 24 alumnos y son 20 clases, ahí las vamos a distribuir. Así que eh, los voy a ir llamando uno por uno. Esta noche, por ejemplo, vamos a comenzar con, con Ada. Right. Ya vamos a ver si Ada puede quedarse 10 minutos después de la clase. Yes. Good. I have another message. No puedo mantener la cámara encendida en la oficina. Ok, good. Así me gusta que, que expliquemos, ¿verdad? Pero me imagino que en la siguiente clase sí, ¿verdad? Este no alcanzo a ver bien, Mario. Mario. Hola, no. soy Mateo. A Mateo, perdón, Mateo, sorry, Mateo. Es que por mi horario, por sí, mi horario sí. no puedo, porque ya y, estoy... Y, ¿Y siempre va a estar con la cámara apagada, Mateo? Sí, a menos que sea algún examen, sí la podría encender, pero tendría que moverme. Ah, eh, okay, por good. mi horario, estoy en una oficina. Ok, but you can participate. A la hora de la clase. Mateo, pero sí puede sí, participar. Sí, yes, okay. sí, bueno, sí sin problema. Ok, good. Thank you, thank you for the... Clarification, right? Vamos a tomar nota. Porque... Ok. Mateo de Jesús Torres, right? Ok. Digis, Digitec. Excelente. Así es. Call ok. Center. Call center. Good. Thank you. Thank you, Mateo. Good. Now, uh... Permisos no disponibles, ¿verdad? Especialmente teacher, pues lo siento, yo no trabajo en la área administrativa, solo doy mi clase, ¿verdad? Y como saben, Insafor da estos cursos gratis, pero la, el requisito es que no faltemos, que no haya permiso. ¿Ok? Good. Now, eh, do you have any question? ¿Hay alguna pregunta? No? Ok. Thank you very much. Now, let's start with the presentation. Here we go, right? Good. Good, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to basic module two. Basic module two, right? This is the presentation of the class or the video conference number one. Today is... August 21st, right? And the topic for today is simple present statements. Oraciones en presente simple, right? This is the topic for today. My name is Javier Gomez, right? And here we have some expressions where you're going to use in class. For example, you can say, excuse me, can you repeat that? Or you can say, how do you spell deletrear, right? How do you spell cat? Meow, meow. C-A-T cat. Or maybe you can say, what is the answer for number four? Teacher, what is the, the answer for number four? 
What is the answer for number three? Et cetera, et cetera, right? What does door mean? What does table mean? What does cat mean, right? Cat is an animal that makes meow, meow. <laughs> okay, English, right? English, English. Or maybe pronunciation. You can say, how do you pronounce this word? Languaje. Languaje no, it's language. Language is the correct pronunciation, right? Okay, very good. And finally, translation. Spanish, English, English, Spanish, right? How do you say cat in Spanish? Gato, right? Gato. El asistente. Ah, no, 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 no. No, cat is, a, is an animal, right? Oh, how do you say a gato in English? Cat. How do you say a window in Spanish? Window? Ventana, right? How do you say ventana in English, right? So in this case, it's English, Spanish, Spanish, English, right? Don't forget that. Practice your English. No Spanish, right? Good. Now, let's go to the presentation. And with the presentation tonight, I will take the attendance. A medida que se vayan presentando, les voy a ir tomando la asistencia, right? Good. Y los que están de oyentes, los voy a dejar para, para después, cuando ya estén activos, okay? So, we're going to start with Ada. Hello, Ada. Are you ready? Okay, so, eh, Brenda Lee? Do you copy Brenda Lee? Present teacher. Okay. Eh, can you introduce yourself to the class, Brenda Lee? Okay. Hello, eh, eh, my name is Brenda Lee Nieto. I live in San Salvador. I work in MSC El Salvador. I like to play, creo que se dice, play mm. guitar. Oh, excelentoso. Thank you very much, Brenda Lee. So okay. uh, I, I have Brenda Lee, is it the same Mediterranean in shipping? No. Sí, Mediterranean Shipping Company. Ah, Excelente. So, very good. Now, eh, Brenda, please. Brenda Elizabeth. Hello, Brenda. Welcome, Brenda. Can you make the introduction to the class, please? Brenda, you ready? Okay, well, I'm going to do something, right? I will turn off the microphones. Voy a apagar unos segunditos el micrófono porque hay una interferencia. Y vamos a esperar que Brenda lo encienda. Okay, Brenda, please. Can you turn on your microphone, please? Oh, yes, good. Now, make the introduction. Hi. Hi. Hi, my name is Brenda Elizabeth Mejia. I live in Ciudad Arce. I work in Hotel Mirador Plaza. I live, I like uh, dog. Very good, Brenda. Welcome to the class. And say hello to everybody in Mirador Plaza, eh? Yeah. Oh, sorry. This is my assistant. Dino. Okay, good. I have two assistants. Also, I have Doodly. Doodly is another dinosaur, right? Do you remember, Brenda? Doodly. Hello, Brenda. Welcome. Okay, very good. Thank you for the presentation, Brenda. Now, uh, Carlos Armando. Hello. Hello. Welcome. My name is Carlos Armando Carpio Abarca. Mm -hmm. I 
mi lugar de trabajo. Eh, no, where do you live? Do you live in Lourdes? Do you live in, in Santa Ana, San Salvador? I live in. I, am, I live in Ciba. Ah, I live in. Yes. I live in. I live in San Miguel. San Miguel, oh. Well, I like San for Miguel. For my trabajo. I understand. I understand. People in San Miguel, Carlos Armando is very warm. Es muy afectuoso, es muy amable la gente de San Miguel. Yes, thank you. Continue. I work yeah. in... I work in... Rodios is boring. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I like... What do you like? I... Lo que me gusta. Yes, I like... I like car, cars. 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 Do you have a car, Carlos? Yes. yes. Excelentoso. Very good. Okay. Honda Civic. Oh, very good car. Yeah, Honda Civic are really good cars, right? But be careful. Yes. Especially when it's raining, right? No, no. Relax, <laughs> relax, relax. Right? No. And no. Do, you, do you like football, Carlos Armando? I imagine. Yes. You're... Aguila. 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 Okay, good. Sorry, I am Alianza, but Aguila is a good team. Yes, congratulations. Oh, no, I... Miguel, right. Yes. It's a good team. It's in the top, right? In this moment. Está en número uno, igual que la Alianza. Yes, congratulations. Sí. Okay, so eh, what do you prefer, Carlos? Carlos Armando, Armando, Carlos, o Carlos Armando? Mm, Carlos. Carlos is okay. Good. Yes. Thank you. So I will call Francisco. Carlos Francisco, Francisco, right? <laughs> okay, good. Now, let's go to Delia Pastora González Sánchez. Delia, hello, hello. Hello. Uh, my name is Delia. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. My name is Delia. I live in Santa Tecla. Uh, I work in Graph Depot. I like to study English. Um, it pupusas. Uh, go uh, go to the gym. Up and down. Only up. up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good, Delia. Welcome back. Bienvenida de nuevo, right? Teacher. Yes, I'm happy because you are <laughs> our teacher again. Oh, I am happy because you are my student again, Delia. <laughs> okay, and everybody, <laughs> all you. everybody, the new students and the old students. <laughs> Okay, thank you very much, Delia. Now, uh, Elsa, please, welcome. Make the presentation, Elsa. 104, 104, Elsa, Elsa. <laughs> Siempre se me olvida encender el micrófono. Ah, <laughs> yes, okay, come on. Es que estaba comiendo. Oh, sorry. Semita en well, no. coffee, semita en coffee. <laughs> Hello. Hello. My name is Elsa. Um, I live in Metapan. I work in Avis. I like uh, I like music. Excellent. Music and Semita. <laughs> yes. <laughs> of course. Yes, of course. <laughs> With coffee. <laughs> yes. Avis, right? Avicola Salazar, right? Okay. Thank you, Elsa. Thank you very much. Now... Eh, Enrique Manuel. Hello, Enrique Manuel. Hello, hello. Okay, so Erenia. Hello, Erenia. Welcome back. Erenia. Hello. Welcome. Nice to see you again. Nice to see you there nice in, see in San... You. In San Miguel, right? Sí. San Michael, San Michael. Like, like, like Carlos, right? Carlos is from San Miguel too. Yeah, nice. Okay, come on, Erenia. Make the presentation. My name is Erenia Pereira. I live in San Miguel. I work in Serpa y Lopez. I like uh, coffee. Ah, do you like what also? Coffee. Ah, coffee. <laughs> I say I like the also then. <laughs> Why is it the coffee good? The coffee, it's nice, right? Coffee is necessary every day. 
you like this coffee right? <laughs> yeah some i told you last time right Irene, that some people drink coffee and they cannot sleep algunas personas eh, toman café y no pueden dormir right <clears throat> but in my case the opposite a mí me pasa lo contrario cuando estoy dormido no puedo tomar café eso difícil okay thank you Irene. thank you very much now evelyn hello evelyn Hi. Welcome back. Welcome back. <laughs> Thank you. Yes, I imagine the, the it's dark, right? Esto oscuro ahí por, uh, el, bebé, por el bebé. Sí, yes, sí, sí, sí. Yeah, I know. Sí. I, I know the story. Don't worry, Evelyn. <laughs> Come on. So make the presentation, okay. please. Okay. Mama, get it, get it. Sí, sí, mi amor. I love this sound, right? My name is Janet Fuentes. Sí. My name is Janet Fuentes. I live in San Martin City. I work in Alcaldía de San Martin. I like see movies. Okay, thank you. Thank you. I remember I used to call you Evelyn, right? Oh, now do you want Janet? Eh, sí. Yo le decía Evelyn, ¿verdad? O, o oh, Janet. Well. Evelyn. Evelyn, it's okay. Okay. Excellent. It's okay. So thank it's you. okay. Thank you very much, right? Okay. Uh, Freddy, please. Welcome to the class, Freddy. Mr. Vasquez Monterrosa, are you there? Okay. So let's continue with Jessica Araceli. Hello, Jessica Araceli. 10-4, 10-4. Miss Diaz Rubayos. Miss Diaz Rubayos, are you there? No, okay. Now, uh, Jonathan. Jonathan Edwards. Hello, Jonathan. How are you? Do you copy? Maybe it's because of the rain. Some people are not in the class, right? Okay, so Kenya. Hi, Kenya. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. It's a pleasure to see you again. <laughs> Va a ser verla de nuevo, Kenya. Okay. Igualmente. Please. My name is Kenya Stephanie. I live in Sayapango. I work in Curtis Industrial. I like listen to music and dance. Dance and be active all the time, right? Energetic. Kenya. <laughs> yeah. yes. Very good. Thank you. Thank you, Kenya. Welcome. Welcome. Now, Maria del Carmen. Hi, good evening. Good evening. Welcome, Maria. <laughs> My name is Maria del Carmen Recino. Uh, I live in Sonsonate. Oh. I work in, in, lo, in Servicio a las Moras. I like cook. coffee. Sí. Coffee? Coffee? Oh, yes. And sí. Coffee yes. and cenita. Eh, María, the, the, the official food for this class is semita. So it's obligation that all the time coffee and semita, okay? Obligation. Okay. <laughs> okay. No, don't okay. worry. It's a joke. Or oh, maybe pupusa. Maybe. <laughs> okay. Eh, María is okay? I can call you María. Yes? Yes. Okay, good. And now I have Mateo, right? Hello, Mateo. Welcome. Hello. Uh, my name is Mateo Torres. I live in, in Ciudad Delgado. I work in Digitex El Salvador. I like drink coffee, play soccer, see movies. Okay, you're a very active boy, eh, Mateo? Nice. Very good. And what is your favorite food, Mateo? Can you tell us? Uh, comida. Yes, the, your favorite food. Yes. What is it? Uh, I like. No sé cómo se dice en inglés. Eh, crema de papa. Sorry. Cre Repeat. Crema de papa. Crema de papas. Eh, eh, potato cream. Uh -huh. Potato cream. <laughs> nice. Uh, it sounds potato good. Potato cream. Uh -huh. <laughs> yes. Okay. And and pacayas. No, eh, <laughs> no, right. No, body like that. No, the chicharron is pork, pork. No, right? es, es. 
No, no me acuerdo cómo se llama, pero es otra carne que le ponen a la sopa de papa. Y lleva también cebollines. cebollines. No idea, bacon, bacon, bacon. Bacon. Ah, bacon. Ese es, es, exactly. es oink, oink, too, right? <ríe> yeah, but stop, Mateo. Stop. I didn't have my dinner, so please, stop. Don't continue, because I will make some papas over there. <ríe> okay, thank you, Mateo, and welcome to the class. Now, eh, Moises. Hello, Moises. Uh, hello, teacher. Hello. Good evening. Uh, my name is uh, Moises Elias Torre Bernal. I live in Apopa City. Oh, nice. I work in I work in uh, the project the agriculture, um, mm -hmm. the ONG uh, Catholic Relief Service. Okay. Uh, I like the the field, nature, um, the coffee, the cocoa. Uh, oh. The cocoa, <laughs> coffee and cocoa. Oh, good combination. Uh, <laughs> okay. yeah yeah the mountain river yeah, the natural i understand uh, me too i love to go to them i have climbed all the volcanoes chinchontepec san salvador santa ana eh, what is the is, in, in la unión is conchagua conchagua is very nice right. yes <laughs> it's very good so nice moises you like the natural natural the natural, natural right natural. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay yeah. thank, thank you. you. And and what is your favorite music, Moises? Um, I am the the, um, the Christian the Christian music. Ah, uh -huh. gospel music, gospel music. Oh, go gospel music. Yeah. Yes, I on, gospel music. I only know uh, Catholic, Dei Verbum, and Evangelic is uh, what is the name of this guy? Uh, the one that sings a Magica Princesa. <laughs> Magica Princesa, yeah. I don't. What is the da, name? Daniel Montero, creo que es. No, no, no. no, no Jesús no. Adrián Romero. Jesús, Jesús Adrián, Adrián Romero, yes. I, I love this song, you know, it's, and it's gospel music, yes. Uh, and from Dave Berber, I'm not Catholic, but I like this, uh, Angeles. Angeles. En este lugar. Angeles uh -huh. en este lugar. Yes, very nice. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I like the music of Stanislao Marino. And, uh, Stanislao Marino. Uh, all music, but... Oh. But this is, is your favorite. Yes, I know. I, I don't know many singers uh, gospel, but, but I imagine this beautiful music. Thank you, Moises. Thank you very much. Okay, now, Wilfredo, Mr. Renderos Leon. Okay, so, William. Hi, William. Welcome Hello. back. Welcome back, William. Thank you. Reloaded, right? Recargado, eh? Yeah. So, so. <laughs> no, no, come on, don't say so, so, say, yes, I am ready to learn English. <laughs> I can do it. Okay, come on, William, make the introduction. And my name is William Antonio Vasquez Samaya. I live in Jocoro. I work in Serpas y Lopez. I like listening to music and play soccer. Okay, excellent. And what is your favorite team, William? Eh, Águila, yeah. Faz, Alianza, Jocoro. No, Jocoro is no more, right? No. Yes, Jocoro. Ah, okay, Jocoro. I view, <laughs> Yes, okay, I know. You have yeah, to support, and, apoyar, yeah. right? Support the Alianza Jocoro. también. Albos. Como no te voy a querer. Okay, <laughs> thank you. Thank you, William, and welcome again to the class. Good. Uh, and then Wilmer Alexander. Wilmer? Hello. Hello, Hello. Wilmer. Welcome. Nice to meet you. Uh, thank you. Okay. Now, please make uh, the introduction. My name, is, okay. my name is Wilmer Mendoza. I live in San Pedro, Peru Lapan. I work in Exportadora Rio Grande. I live typical food. Oh, typical food. Yuquita, nuegados. Yes. Eh, yeah. Chuco. Do you like chuco, Wilmer? No. No. Es oh. lo único que <laughs> Come on. Chuco with pan francés, right? Frigolito, right? Come on, Wilmer. <laughs> yeah. And in San Miguel, for example, right? In San Miguel, is is sweet. The chuco, Wilmer. The chuco is sweet. It's dulce. 
Uh -huh. Ajá, es diferente. The color is different. El rosado Sal -sal y también venden del verde que uno está acostumbrado en la otra uh, zona. Then, I washed it because we put a lot of I washed it, right, Carlos? So, Ajá, verde it, por el I washed it, creo yo. Uh -huh, yes, Pero el otro es rosado y es dulce. Yeah, y es feo. No, no le digas así, ya, cámara. <laughs> okay. No sabe rico. Yeah, you don't like it, but in San Salvador, I prefer salty. A mí me gusta más salado, right? So, but Wilmer say, no, no, no sweet, no salty, ni salado, ni dulce, but Wilmer. <laughs> no. Oh, only, only the lot of loco, el lot of loco. Pose con mayonesa yes. y salsa negra. Ah, okay. Look, in San Miguel, right? But Wilmer in San Pedro, Pedro La Pan, only curtidito en salsita, right? Only, right? The pupusas. The pupusas. A good, right? Wilmer, is a good pupusería in San Pedro, Pedro La Pan? Sí. Yes. yes. Tell me one. Si algún día llevo para, cuando voy para Suchitoto, paso por ahí, ¿no? <laughs> so, That's recommendation. Serious. Recommendation, recommendation. Pupusería la niña Julia, ¿no? <laughs> <laughs> Not in a, no, no name, right? oh, okay, but, but it, <laughs> yeah, they are good. Thank you, Wilmer, and welcome to this class, right? Good. Now I will go to the listeners. Ahora nos vamos con los oyentes, a ver si ya están des, desoyentados. <laughs> Let me see. Eh, Francisco, ¿podría hacer la introducción, Francisco? Okay, I guess not, right? Ingrid? Hello, hello. Ah, okay, Francisco. Hello, Francisco. Can you make the introduction? Yes. Yes, okay, come on. Go ahead. Um, my name is Carlos Francisco Alfaro de León. I live in Santiago, Texacuango, city of San Salvador. Uh, I work in Airport International of the El Salvador. I like it listen top of music. Oh. I practice in uh, guitar and piano. You're a music man, Francisco. You're a yes. music man. Nice. Congratulations. Yes, it's, it's a it's a it's a very good ability. It's, it's a special, nice. Very good. So someday if you want, you can play the guitar for the class, no problem. I and you can sing in English, Francisco. It's possible. Um, yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, welcome. Prox Proximamente. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, with the guitar, Francisco. Aha. Nice. Okay, welcome, Francisco. <laughs> teacher, you, you en unos... back... teacher eh... me avisa Excuse cuando me, esté eh... listo, yes. Eh... Me avisa, no hay problema, no problem, yes. Yes, I copy here. Okay, right? yeah. eh, perdón, okay. aprovechando que Francisco me está eh, um, haciendo notar la situación, eh, quiero hacerles eh, ver cómo vamos a trabajar, ¿verdad? Cuando alguien me dice, mire, teacher, voy en la, el tráfico, o mire, dentro de unos minutos. Eh, está bien, póngame oyente, pero, eh, bueno, espero que no sea todas las clases. Pero si es así, pues me ponen, mire, teacher, hoy voy a estar de oyente. Y cuando ya estén en casita, me tiran el mensaje. Teacher, ya estoy en casa. Ok, ya puedo participar. Porque recuérdense que la, la clave de este curso es participar, ¿verdad? Si uno no, no habla, no produce, pues ¿cómo? ¿Cómo vamos a aprender, verdad? Así que la clave es esa, que participen. Y a mí me gusta, bueno, los, los chicos que estuvieron conmigo en Básico 1 ya saben que me gusta la participación, ¿verdad? Que todos estén activos. Y, y entre más participemos, más rápido vamos a aprender inglés. ¿Ok? Así que los chicos nuevos, ¿verdad? Ahí Francisco, Carlos, Mateo y todos los, Moisés, todos los chicos nuevos. Eh, esa es mi dinámica. Me gusta, bueno, a veces hace mucho sueñito, a veces estamos, ¿verdad? Es necesario el coffee a veces, pero, pero sí, ahí estamos con los ánimos encendidos siempre, ¿verdad? ¿Ok? Para que ustedes aprendan. Y ahí estamos a sus órdenes, cualquier pregunta. A veces es muy poco es un poco difícil expresarlo en inglés, así que si quieren me lo, me lo preguntan en español, la más no poder, y luego traducimos. Pero ahí estoy a sus órdenes, ¿ok? Good, thank you. And now, Ingrid, Jessica Carolina, María René. Teacher. Ok, vamos a ver quién puede hacer la introducción. Yes. Ingrid. Ingrid, Ingrid ok. Pero sigue de oyente, Ingrid. 
Sí, pero unos 15 minutos quizás ya okay, pueda good, good, good. Come on. Ok, go ahead, Ingrid. Hi, my name is Ingrid. I live in Lourdes. I work in Wait, La Ingrid. Geo. Ingrid, Lourdes. Lourdes, Colón. No, do, Lourdes, Dólar. <laughs> <laughs> ok, La Geo, La Geo. Continue, continue. I like coffee. Uh -huh. Not only coffee. Remember, the official yes. food, coffee and semita, Ingrid. Not only coffee. I see. Sí, es yes. Yes, sure. The semita is very basic. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you. Thank you and welcome back. Welcome back. Bienvenida a regreso, right? Thank you. Thank Good. you, teacher. Okay, then Maria René and René Alexin, I don't know. No sé si ya pueden hacer la introducción. Uh, yo, teacher. Ok, Alexi. Hello, Alexi. Welcome. Welcome back. Hello, hello. Good evening. Uh, Good evening. My name is René Alexi Caballero Maya. I live in Colón La Libertad. I work in Grupo Miguel. I live in Pupusa, soccer y basketball. Basketball. Okay, excellent. Uh, Alexi is a sport man, right? Chico deportista, yes. Thank you, Alexi, and welcome back to the class. Good. Now, I will check the ones that are not in the class. Solo voy a chequear a los chicos que no, no he chequeado ni como oyentes ni como participantes. Ada Concepción. Enrique Manuel. Freddy. Jessica Araceli, Jonathan, Wilfredo. No, okay, good. So let's start with the class. Let's continue. Ah, I have a message here. Vamos a ver, tengo un mensaje. Aún no puedo, sigo en tráfico. Okay, María René, right? Okay, no problem, María René. I understand. Aquí le he puesto como oyente. Ahí siga. Ojalá no haya apretado mucho en el microbús o en el bus y pueda estar escuchando la clase, ¿ok? Good, now let's continue, right? We are going to introduce with class number one. Uh, the name of the unit one is Work Related Events, right? Work Related Events. And then it says, let's read the, the, the objective, please. William, can you help me, please? Read the objective for the class. Unit one, word relates event. I will be able to describe regular activities in the workplace. Thank you, William. So what activities do you do in your work? What activities do you do in your company? For example, what activities does Carlos do in Rodeo Swiss, Swiss Boring, right? Or what activities does Elsa do in Avicola Salazar, right? Avis. Or what activities does Evelyn do in Alcaldía San Martin, right? So what are the activities that you regular do, regularly do every day in your company? Good. Today is Monday, right? So imagine today, I don't know, for example, I imagine uh, Erenia, right? Going to, to the work, Erenia. Going to Lopez, S.A. de Sever, right? And Monday, right? Seven o'clock, Erenia to the work, right? Eight o'clock, start the work. So, Erenia, what activities do you do Every Monday, ¿qué son las tres cosas que regularmente siempre hace los lunes? Erenia? What are the first things you do on Mondays? Con horas. Sorry? Con horas. Mm, if you want, no necessary, but yes, if you, if you want. On Mondays. Mm -hmm. Three activities for Mondays. 
go to the work. Uh -huh. eh, Transportation. Eh, mm. Eh, create report. Okay, make reports. Listen, class. Erenia makes reports every Monday. Reports. Okay, what else? In, uh, check emails. Check, check emails. Go to work, check emails, and make reports. Listen, Erenia goes to work, Erenia makes reports, and Erenia sends emails. Good. Thank you very much, Erenia. Now, Brenda Lee, how many times a day do you check your email, Brenda Lee? Uh, I check email every day. Uh -huh. One, two, three, every day. How many times? ¿Cómo cuántas veces lo revisa? How many times? Uf. Todo el día. Every All minute. Time. Every minute. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yes. Thank you, Brenda Lee. Thank you, Brenda Lee. Okay, now, a question for Kenya. The same question, Kenya. What are three activities or three first activities you do on Mondays, Kenya? Um, number one, read the word report. Read, read reports, uh-huh. Uh-huh. Listen the material. Prima, the product. Uh -huh. product. Good. Uh, materia prima is raw material, right? Raw, ah, raw uh -huh. material. The ah, product sorry, print. Kenya, for a moment I thought you said listen to music <laughs> in the ah. world. <laughs> no, it's not possible, no. right? Yeah, I know. Continue, continue. A veces sí. <laughs> okay. But in English, <laughs> Kenya, in English. Good. Sí. Continue. One more activity, Kenya. Check. One more activity. Check emails. Check emails. Good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now, uh, Moises, how many times a day do you check your email, Moises? Moses. In English, you say Moses, right? Okay. Uh -huh. uh, um, I am the check the email um, every day. Uh -huh. But how many times? Cuántas veces al día? Average. This one. Uh, well, 25, 25. 25, <laughs> 25 times. It's very frequently, right? Very frequently. Okay, thank very, you very much. frequently. Uh huh. Nice. So, thank you. Thank you, Moises. Okay. Good. Okay. Now, and here's the vocabulary for today, class. Look, attend. Attend is be present in an event or in a meeting, right? Take part. For example, uh, let's say Kenya is attending the English class. So in other words, Kenya is, right, uh, present in this class. Kenya is part of this class, right? Attend, when you attend a class. Good. Organize. Organize is to make preparations for events or meetings. It's coordinate something, coordination, you know, coordinate. For example, uh, the teacher, me, I prepared this class. Right, so um, I organize this class. I say, uh, okay, Kenya, Brenda Lee, you participate, Moses, and I prepare the I I prepare the PowerPoint, right? So I organize organize this class. Actually, actually is not actualmente. No, 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 no. Actually is not actualmente. Actually is in effect, en verdad. Like you say. La verdad es que a mí me gustan las pupusas revueltas, right? Actually. Mm -hmm. Or in effect, right? Good. Now, with this vocabulary, we go to the conversation. Look. Sofía and Mario. Mm -hmm. Sofía say, what do you do every Monday morning? And Mario says, I check my email and I call clients for the rest of the morning. What about you? Yes, what about you in, in El Salvador is Yvonne, right? <laughs> what about you? Sofia says, I have to read a weekly report 
and attend a meeting. I also have to organize meetings every two Mondays. How often do you check your email? Do you check it every day? And Moises, no, sorry, Moises, no. Mario says, yes, I do actually. La verdad que sí lo hago, right? I check it once or twice a day, right? In the case of Moises, 25, <laughs> very frequently, right? Okay, but in the case of Mario, says only one time or two times. Like me, the teacher, I check my email just once a day, right? Okay, and Sophia said, great. It is very important. It is very important. Okay, class, listen and repeat, please. Are you ready? Repeat after me. Uh, remember that we're going to turn off the microphones. Vamos a apagar los micrófonos por cuestión de... Del ruido, ¿verdad? Porque no, no podemos todos hablar porque se distorsiona el ruido, la, lamentablemente. Si estuviéramos personal, pues sí, ¿verdad? Pero aquí en clase, pues ni modo, hay que apagar el micrófono. So, give me a second. Somebody, somebody is knocking at the door. Give me a second. Excuse me, one second. You can read the conversation for a moment, please. Sorry. Sorry, excuse me. Uh, there is a song from some from Paul McCartney. The name of the song is uh, something like this, right? Someone is knocking knocking at the door. <laughs> Someone's knocking at the door. Someone's ringing the bell. You know. Okay, so excuse me. In my house, someone was knocking the door. That's why I interrupt. Now, uh, repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. What do you do every Monday morning? What do you do every Monday morning? Okay. Only Evelyn, please. Repeat, please. Only Evelyn. Give me a second. Yes. What do you do every every Monday morning? Uh -huh, like a question, Evelyn. What do you do every Monday morning? Um, the intonation, the intonation. What do you do every... What do you do every Monday morning? Okay, excellent. Now, everybody, everybody, please. I check my email... Come on, repeat, please. And I call clients for the rest of the morning. What about you? Good. Now, can you help me? Um, let me see. Alexi, can you help me? Repeat this part, please. Only you. Only you. Alexi? No, teacher. Repeat this part, please. Only you. Repeat. El de Mario, ¿verdad? Yes. Uh, I shake me a meal. My? My? And my... My uh in cut client wait 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 relax my email my email and and I cut cut clients and for the rest of the morning what's up about Yo. Again, what about you? Repeat, what about you? What about you? Excellent. Thank you, Alex. Everybody, repeat after me, please. 
I have to read a weekly report. And attend a meeting. I also have to organize meetings. Every two Mondays. How often do you check your email? Do you check it every day? Good. Wilmer, please. Only you, Wilmer, repeat. Mr. Mendoza Garcia, please. Ready? Repeat, please. Only you. I have to read. I have to read a, a weekly report and attend a meeting. I so I also have to organize 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 organize, organize meetings every two Mondays. How often do you check your email? Like a do question, Wilmer, Wilmer. How often do you check your email? How often do you check your email? Good, excellent. Continue. Do you? Do you check? Do you check it every day? No, like a question, Wilmer. Do you check it every day? Repeat. Do you check it every day? And you know, like cantadito, you know. Do you check it every day? Do you check it every day? Good. Thank you very much. Everybody, yes, I do actually. Yes, I do actually. I check it once yeah. or twice a day. Good. Maria, please. Maria, can you repeat that? Yes. 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 I do actually. I check. I it sounds. I once, once. Wait, wait, Maria. Uh, I, I, I check. check. It. No, no. Wait. I check mm -hmm. it. I check it. Uh, I check it once or twice. Right. Twice. Oh, for tw twice. Uh, I check. I check it. I one for twice. A day. El, a day. Okay. Thank you, Maria. Only for that, Dool is going to give you claps. <laughs> Congratulations, Maria. <laughs> nice. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Good. Now, repeat after me, please. Great. It is very important. Mateo, please repeat that part. Great. It, it is very important. Good. Thank you very much. Now, uh, we're going to practice this conversation, but before to practice, uh, we're going to answer this, acti uh, this question, right? What activities do Mario and Sofia do on Mondays? Mario and Sofia, right? Let's start with Mario. Volunteer, please. Mario mm -hmm. uh, Delia. Checks, checks his emails and calls clients. And Sofia? And Sofia uh, reads a weekly report and attends a meeting. And, and organ organize, 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 no, organize, meeting, or, organize meetings uh, every two Mondays. Okie dokie. Also, Delia, you have class from Dudley again, right? Okay, very good. Now, next question. 
do you consider, or in your opinion, uh, that it is important to check your email every day? This is not yes. the question for, 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 for the conversation, but it's personal, right? Yes. Ah, it's very yes, it's very important. Why? I have a large I have a lot in myself uh, because my boss uh, sent sent us um, many emails. And so you have to read it every day, right? Communication is really special, right? And the way you communicate the success, the exit, right, of your company. Good. Now we're going to practice this conversation, everybody. So let's repeat the last time, the last, last time. Repeat after me, please. Okay. What do you do every Monday morning? I check my email. And I call clients for the rest of the morning. What about you? I have to read a weekly report and attend a meeting. I also have to organize meetings every two Mondays. How often do you check your email? Do you check it every day? Yes, I do actually. I check it once or twice a day. Once or twice a day. Great. It is very important. Okay, very good. Now let me see here, right? Good. Now let's start practicing the conversation. But before to practice, I will check the attendance again. Remember, we have to check it three times, right? So Ada, say present. Brenda Lee? Present. Eh, Brenda? Present. Carlos? Well, Carlos? Carlos Armando. Eh, I will say... Present. Uh, we have two Carlos, right? Carlos Armando and Carlos Francisco. But eh, uh, Carlos Armando, we say Carlos. And Carlos Francisco, we say Francisco, okay? For to avoid confusion, right? right? Mm -hmm. So when I okay. say Carlos, it's, it's Carlos okay. Armando, right? Okay. Good. Present Carlos Let's go. Armando. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Excellent. Now, Francisco, you ready to participate? Ya está listo para participar, Francisco? Yes, teacher. Yes, excellent also. Very good. Thank you. Now, Delia? Present teacher, present. Okay. Eh, Elsa? Present teacher. Enrique Manuel. Erenia. Erenia. Miss Pereira. Primero. Ah, okay, very good. Ya me he afligido, perdón. <laughs> afligido. Yes, okay. Eh, Evelyn. Here I am. 
Thank you. Uh, Freddy? Absent, right? Good. Ingrid? Present, teacher. Ok, ya puede participar, Ingrid. ¿o ¿Sigue de oyente? Yes, teacher, ya. Yeah. Ok, excellent. Thank you. Jessica Araceli? Jessica Carolina? Hello, teacher. Hello. Eh, ya puede participar, Estoy Jessica. Ah, ok, good. No problem, I understand. Eh, Jonathan? Kenia? Present. Teacher, quería yes. solicitarle permiso para poder desactivar la cámara porque ya están saliendo aquí los pacientes en el hospital. Ah, ok. Como los lunes y jueves vengo con sí, mi entiendo, papá al seguro. Sí. Sí, ya, ya sé cuál es la situación especial, no se preocupe. Ya. Go ahead. Siga adelante. Ok, estamos todos deseosos que eh, algún día se pueda recuperar su papi y ya deje ese proceso tan difícil, ¿verdad? Ya he tenido muchos casos yo en mi escuela, ¿verdad? Así es que yo sé lo difícil que es, que es que la felicito. Ok, good. Eh, María. Present. Good. Eh, María René. Sigue oyente, ¿verdad, María René? Si puede mandarme mensaje, por favor. Al chat. Mateo. Present. Moisés. Present. Alexi. Present, teacher. Ya puede participar, ¿verdad, Alexi? Yes. Ok, excelente. Wilfredo Renderos. William. Present. Wilmer. Present. Thank you very much. Thank ah, aquí tengo un mensajito. Let me see. Eh, María René. Ok, good. Thank you. Está presente, María René. De, de oyente. Good. Now, let's continue, please. Uh, let's practice the conversation. Sofía is going to be Brenda Lee. And Wilmer, you're going to be Mario, right? Ready? One, yes. two, three, action. What did you do every Monday morning? I'd say... I check my email and I call clear for the rest of the morning. What about you? I, ha I have to read a weekly report and attend a meeting. I also have to organize, organize meeting every two Monday. How often do you check your email? Do you check it every day? Yes, I do actually. I check I I check it once or twice a day. Great. It is very important. Okay, thank you. Good participation, right? And look at this word uh, clients. Listen, repeat Wilmer clients. Clients. Die. No, clients. 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 Mm -hmm. I call clients. Thank you, clients. Okay. Very good. Thank you, Wilman. Clients. Okay. Yes, excellent. Now, uh, I need Brenda, please. Brenda, your Sophia. And William, your Mario. Go ahead, please. Action. What do you do every Monday morning? I check my email and I call client for the rest of the morning. What about you? I have to read a weekly report and attend a meeting. I also have to organize meetings every two Monday. How often do you check your email? Do you check it every day? Yes, I do actually. 
I check it once or twice a day. Great. It is very important. I'm sorry. Tenía el micrófono apagado. Qué oso, right? <laughs> okay, excuse me. Uh, congratulations. Okay, Brenda and, and, and Will, William. Now, look at this, William. Check it. Repeat, please. Check it. Check it. Mm. Once. Once. Or twice. Or twice. Excellent. Very good. Now, next practice, please. Uh, Carlos, you're going to be Mario. And Alexi, you're going to be Sofia, please. Ready? One, two, three, action. What do you do every day Monday, Monday morning? Carlos? Carlos Armando, please. Mr. Carpio Abarca, are you there? Dios cuatro, Dios cuatro. Okay, so, Francisco, help me, please. Can you take the part of Mario, please? Right. I check my email and I call clients for the rest of the morning. What about you? I had to read a weekly report and attend a meeting and all uh, to organize meeting. Okay, wait, 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 Alexi. I also, uh -huh. I also, I also have to organize and to the orga organize a meeting and every day to Monday. How often do you do you check your email? Do you check it every day? Okay, like a question, Alexi. Do you check it every day? Do you check it every day? Yes, I do actually. I check it once or, or twice a day. Great. In, in, it is very important. Important, right? Important. Hey, thank you very much, Alexi and Francisco. Thank you very much. Now, Delia, please, your Sophia. And Moises, you're going to be Mario. Let's ready. One, what two, I... three, action. What do you do every Monday morning? I check my email and I call clients for the rest of the morning. What about you? I have to read a weekly report and attend a meeting. I also have to organize state meetings every two Mondays. How often do you check your emails? Do you check it every day? Yes, I do actually. I check in the once or twice a day. Great, this is very important. Okie dokie, thank you. Good participation, right? Nice. Okay, let's continue. <clears throat> Sorry, Elsa, you're going to be Sofia. And let me see. We have Mateo, now Maria Rene. Maria, right? Maria, you're going to be Mario. Right? Yes. Okay. Yes. One, two, three, action. What did you do every Monday morning? I check my email. I call friends for the rest of the morning. What about you? I have to be able to report and, and, and attend a meeting. I also have to organize meetings every two Mondays. How often do you check your email? Do you check every day? Yes, I do actually. I check, I check it on uh, twice a day. Right. It is, it is very very important. Okie dokie. Very good. Now listen, call clients. Call clients. Call clients. Mm -hmm. Organize. Organize. 
Check it. Check it. Once or twice. Maria, listen. Check it. Check it. Once or twice. Or twice. Are they right? Yes. Good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, okay. Now I have a message here in the chat. Give me a second. Eh, la lluvia está perdiendo la señal, dice Mario, right? No, Mateo, Mateo. Okay, I understand, Mateo. Good, I understand. Now, uh, two more, two more students. We're going to have Erenia, please. Erenia in Kenya. Erenia, ah, no, no, Kenya in this moment, no, I guess, I don't remember. Creo que la cámara me dijo Kenya, no, no, no. So maybe it's going to be Evelyn. Yes, Erenia and Evelyn. Yes, and we finish. Erenia, you're going to be Sofia. Evelyn, you're going to be Mario. Ready? Action. What do you do every Monday morning? Well, I check my emails and I call clients for the rest of the morning. What about you? I have to read a weekly report and attend um, meetings. I also have to organize meetings. Every two Mondays, how often do you check your email? Do you check it every day? Yes, I do actually. I check it once or twice a day. Great. It, it is a very important. Okay, thank you very much. Now, look at this pronunciation. It's difficult, but let's try it. Erenia and Evelyn say, check it. Check it. Come on, check it. Check it. Oh, thank you very much. Right? Now let's continue. In this moment, we're going to, to go to the topic. What is the topic? Is the simple present, right? Ladies and gentlemen, the simple present is one of the several forms of present tense in English, right? El presente simple es una de las tantas formas del presente, right? Presente simple. No presente continuo ni nada. Presente simple, right? It is used to describe habits. Nos ayude para eh, describir hábitos, rutinas, right? eventos repetidos y en general cosas que son ciertas, ¿no? Como que la luna es redonda, como que el agua moja, etcétera, etcétera, right? Okay, but the most important part here is habits, routines, right? ¿Qué es lo que hacen ustedes todos los días? Se levantan, se bañan, se cepillan los dientes, se ponen maquillaje unos, otros se, se rasuran, agarran el chuzón, la moto, el mototaxi, ok, o el carrito, ¿verdad? Y se van a su trabajo, ¿sí? ¿yes? Luego ahí en su trabajo eh, hacen reportes, contestan el, el teléfono, eh, organizan mm, reuniones, etcétera, etcétera, right? So it's a routine. Luego almuercito, a trabajar en la tarde, que es la parte más difícil. Luego regresar a casita y cena. And then English class. All right. Ahora ya incorporaron a sus actividades esta clase de inglés. Así que lo felicito por ese gran esfuerzo. El estar ahorita ahí, ¿qué hora son? What time is it? It's son las nueve, nueve y veinte, right? Imagínense, ahorita pueden estar durmiendo, pero aquí están aprendiendo inglés. Congratulations, yes. Esta es una rutina que vamos a tener por 20 clases, ¿no? Sí, espero que puedan estar a to en todas las sesiones. Yes, espero. Yes, good. Entonces, ¿cómo describimos eso? Esa rutina se describe con el presente sí. En sí, sí. Look, we have subject and verb, right? We say, I take, you take, we take, they take, right? Y cuando es una tercera persona, le vamos a agregar una S al verbo. En lugar de decir, he take, vamos a decir, he takes. 
En lugar de decir she takes, vamos a decir she takes, right? Good. This is the introduction, right? Now, this is the structure. In the simple present, we have the subject, the verb, oh, I'm sorry, and the complement, right? And you say, I attend meetings every Monday. I attend meetings every Monday. Right? Good. And when it's third person singular, we say, she makes phone calls. You don't say she make. No, no, no. We say she makes phone calls, right? Good. Let's continue, right? Now, here we have some example of the simple present in affirmative. I make phone calls. You make phone calls. We make phone calls. They make phone calls. Sylvia and Candy make phone calls. Okay. Uh, Maria and Erenia make phone calls. Now, third person singular, we say, she makes phone calls. He makes phone calls. He, it makes phone calls. My friend makes phone calls. Oscar makes phone calls. William makes phone calls. Wilmer makes phone calls, etc., etc. Right? Notice subject, verb, and complement. Subject, verb, and complement. Right? That's it. Now, here we have some of the activities we, we make every day at work. Listen, please. No policies. Know the regulations. Help workers. Help people. Help the company. Advertise the company. Design softwares. Develop softwares. Answer the phone. Make phone calls. Okay, now please repeat after me. Repeat after me. Know the policies. Know the policies. Know the regulations. Help workers. Help people. Help the company. Advertise the company. Design softwares. Develop softwares. Answer the phone. Make phone calls. Right? Okay. Who wants to read for me? Volunteer, please. Alguien que quiera leerlo nuevamente. Volunteers. I am. Okay, please. Come on, uh, go ahead, Moises. Uh, now the police. Now the regulation. Help workers. Help people. Help the company. Advertise the company. Design softwares. Develop softwares. Answer the phone. May from the calls. Excellent. Very good, Moises. Thank you. Now, class, do you have any question about vocabulary? These are some of the activities that you do every day in your work, right? Estas son de, la una, de las actividades que ustedes hacen en su trabajo, right? So, sure. and, yes? Uh, the meaning of the develop is desarrollar. It's correct. Yes. yes. Okay. It's correct. And, and uh, advertise. How do you say, say Delia? How do you say advertise in Spanish? Um, no, no. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, teacher, what the meaning advertise? Advertise is to make publicity for a product. Uh, publicity for a product. Yes. In Marketing. This case, Marketing. Advertising is similar to marketing, yes. 
And then, okay. uh, Delia, you. you can say like this. How do you say advertise in Spanish? Is How do you say advertise in Spanish? Publicitar, anunciar. Publicitar. Mm -hmm. Thank you, teacher. Anytime. Other question, class? Do you have questions? No. Okay, let's continue. Let's continue, babies. Now, write reports, send reports, send emails, arrange meetings, carry boxes, carry products, keep track, repair computers, ask for assistance. Good. Repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. Write reports. Send reports. Send emails. Arrange meetings. Arrange meetings. Carry boxes. Carry products. Keep track. Repair computers. Ask for assistance. Ask for assistance. Okay, class, any question about the meaning? Questions, questions? Teacher, mm -hmm. how, how do you do say, you say uh, in Spanish? How do, repeat, please. How do you say? Ask. How do you say? No. Keep track. Ah, keep track. Keep, eh, llevar registro, llevar control de algo. Thank you. Yes, keep track. Llevar archivos también, ¿verdad? Porque a veces uno va llevando el control de ciertos productos y va guardando los, los archivos en la, en la compu. Mm -hmm. Hoy para todos se usa la compu. ¿no? Uh, teacher. Ajá, uh yes. -huh, How do you say arrange meeting in Spanish, please? Arreglar o, o preparar reuniones. Oh, okay. mm -hmm. Thank you. Arrange meeting. Thank Good. Any other question? Now, who wants to read again, please? Volunteers, who wants to read again? Your teacher. Okay, thank you, Francisco. Go ahead. Write reports, send reports, send emails, arrange meetings, carry books, carry products, keep track, Prepare computers. Ask for assistance. Very good. Thank you. Thank you very much. Right? Now, let's go to the last. Install programs. If you work with computer, install programs. Sell products. Exchange information. Buy new merchandise. Receive money. Decide what to buy. Transport products. Fix cars. Again, come on, repeat after me, please. Repeat after me. Install programs. Sell products. Exchange information. Buy 
buy new merchandise. My favorite activity, receive money. <laughs> Decide what to buy. Transport products. Fix cars. Good. Any question? Any question? Yo, yo quiero que ah, Moisés. De la presentación yeah. lo que me gustaba. Hoy voy a decir mejor lo que me gusta de Receive Money. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, no, but, but Moisés, so the problem is sometimes it's not your money, right? If you work in a bank, it's not your money. Only, oh, you receive the money and you pass the money, right? Yes, it is similar to the to the salary, Moises. The they pay the salary and then you oh only pay the electricity, pay the anda, pay the the food, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera, right? Okay, class. Any question? No questions. Now we're going to make. Let me see. We have. Oh no, this is is only that. So, uh, I will ask one student, uh, and you're going to tell me what do you do in your job, right? For example, I say uh, Elsa, for example, right? And then Elsa is going to say, I help people. I answer the phone, etc., etc., for example, right? Now, but I will start with Brenda Lee. Brenda Lee. What of these activities do you do in your job, Brenda Lee? Give us example, Brenda Lee. Um, I answer the phone. Uh -huh. Only that. Okay. okay. I help people. Oh. make phone calls okay you make phone calls nice thank you Brenda Lee Carlos Carlos Armando Francisco I know the regulation uh -huh. in I help people. And design software. Oh, interesting, Francisco. Congratulations. Nice. Okay, now what of this what about these activities? Delia? What of these activities do you do in okay. your job? I I write reports. Send reports, send emails. I say I send email. I send email. I send emails. I uh, keep track. I ask for assistance. Okay, nice, very good. Now, uh, Elsa, please. What about you, Elsa? What of this activity do you do in your? office in your work? I read weekly reports. Mm -hmm. I write reports. I send reports. I, I arrange things. And I keep track. Okay, thank you, right? So everything related with reports every day, eh? Nice, Elsa. Yeah. Good. You're a busy yeah. woman. <laughs> yeah. Una chica yeah. ocupada, right? Good. Now, what about these activities? Uh, let me see. Erenia? What of these activities do you do in your job, Erenia? Uh-huh, uh-huh. What of these activities do you do in your job, Erenia? Come on, answer, please. Yeah. Oh, let me see. I have a message here. Uh, Maria Rene. Oh, thank you, Maria Rene. Very good. 
and welcome. Erenia? No, okay, so Evelyn, please, can you help me, Evelyn? What of these activities do you do in your job, please? Well, um, I'm sorry. No, 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 then, ninguna. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, okay. No. Receive money? No, no, you don't receive money. No, no, sorry, no. A lot of compromise, right? No, I wish. Uh, I wish is your you receive that the money, but for you, but no. <laughs> okay, thank you. Sharia, but no. Yeah, no, no, right. I send emails and okay. Great reports. But no, 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 no. Others, no. others. Okay. I understand. Okay, thank you, thank you, Evelyn. Okay, now, Maria Rene, welcome to the class. Welcome, Maria Rene. Listen. What Hi. of these activities do you do in your job, Maria Rene? Um, I exchange information. Uh -huh. um, Only that. Only okay. That. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Right? Okay. Now, class. And... These are activities you do in your job, right? But look, you can add to this expression some expression of time. For example, I can say, I check my email, right? But when? Every day, once a day, twice a week, three times a month, on Wednesday, once a day, once a month, every Monday, every day, right? So these are time expressions. Now I say, I check my email every day. I type a letter once a day. They write a report twice a week. She attends a meeting three times a month. He calls clients on Wednesdays. You read a report one a report once a day. Una vez al día, right? Once a day. She visits clients once a month. Una vez al mes va a visitar a los clientes. Ah, nice. My boss organizes meetings every Monday. Oh. <laughs> yes, mi jefe organiza todos los lunes una reunión, right? It's necessary. My coworker answers the phone every day, right? Good. Now, what about you? I check my email. Mm -hmm. So in this case, uh, Ingrid, can you use one of these time frequency, Ingrid, and say, I check my email? I check my email every day. But what other expression can you use, Ingrid? ¿Qué otra expresión pudiera usar ahí? I check my email. I write my email uh -huh. every day. Every day, too. Okay, every day. Thank you. Thank you very much, Ingrid. Now, um, let me see. Ah, Kenya, please. Uh, no sé si ya está en casita, Kenya. ¿Puede participar? No, okay, tranquila. Hola, teacher. No, todavía no, no, no. estoy tranquila. esperando todavía. No importa, tranquila. Solo escuche la clase entonces, no, no se preocupe. Ok, María, please. I type a letter. Escribe eh, cartas en su trabajo, María. No. Llama a los clientes. No. Yes. Ok, so please. I call clients, eh? Maria, I call clients. Repeat, I, um, call, I call clients. I call clients. When? Every day, once a day, twice a week. On when? Every day. Every day. Okay, you see? 
So these expressions, yes. in, thank you, thank you very much. These expressions indicates the frequency where you do this activity, right? Any question? Now. Arrive at the company at 7 a.m. Can you help me, please? Uh, Maria Rene? Complete the sentence, Maria Rene. Yeah, right. He arrives. At 7 he arrives at the company at 7 a.m., right? Thank you. Number two, please. Uh -huh. After Maria Rene, I have Mateo. No sé si se pudo incorporar al final, Mateo. Hello, Mateo. Okay. Uh, Moises, please. Number two. Uh, he opened the store before breakfast. Open or opens, Moises? Open, opens. Opens. Uh, okay. Tercera persona. Excellent. Excellent. Very good. Okay. Now, let's continue with number three, please. Start working, right? Start working. Uh, Alexi? Hi, teacher. Number three, Alexi. Uh huh. He. The action is in parentheses, Alexi. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, uh -huh. He. Stars. Stars, correct. He starts working at 8 a.m. Recomienza a trabajar a las 8. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Now let's go to the next one, please. Number four, right? After Alexi, who's going to help me? Uh, William, please. Number four, William. He checks email at 10 p.m. Is correct. Checks email. Well, now let's go to number five. Wilmer, can you help me with number five, please? Mr. Mendoza Garcia, do you copy? 10-4, 10-4. Wilmer, presentarse a cabina, presentarse a cabina. No, oh, okay. So, Brenda Lee, please, can you help me with number five, Brenda Lee? Um, he has? He has, correct. Lunch, lunch at 12 p.m. Good. At 12 p.m., right? Launch. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's go to number six. Send report 4 p.m., right? So, Brenda, please. He sends. Totally correct. He sends. A report at 4 p.m., right? Number seven, please. The store. The store, right? Uh, Carlos? Francisco, please. Help me, Francisco. He closes. The store at 5 p.m. It's totally correct, right? Closes. Mm -hmm. Number eight. 
Uh, let me see, Delia. He comes home at 6 p.m. Comes home, right? Okay, and number nine, please. After Delia, Elsa, please. He has dinner at eight o'clock. He has dinner, and you mean you mean at eight o'clock, right? He has dinner at eight o'clock. Okay. Now and number ten. Let me see if I have ten. Oh yes, to finish number ten, right? Who's going to make it? Uh, already have Elsa and Irenia. So Evelyn, please finish with number ten, Evelyn. Um, number 10 he right goes, he goes he goes to bed go totally right Evelyn all right yes he goes to bed at nine okay this is the daily routine of a person right you go to the company 7 a.m you open this, the business, maybe the company or the store. You start working at 8. You send emails at 10. You have lunch, 12, right? You make reports or send reports. Close the store or the company, right? And a uh, la cita, a uh, la cita. So come home at 6, right? And yumi yumi at 8. And to sleep 9 a.m., right? Do you have similar daily activities? Yes or no? Let me say to this question to uh, to let me see Maria Rene, please, Maria Rene. Do you have similar activities, Maria Rene, like this? Or different? Similar. Similar, okay. The only difference is that at 3 p.m. pupusas and coffee, right? <laughs> that is the <laughs> difference. Okay, thank you very much. Now, uh, Moises, please. What about you? Do you have a similar schedule, horario similar? Or daily oh, activities? No. no, no, no. For example, oh. what time do you start working, Moises? What time do you start working? Um, I am to start working on the five or, or six. Five uh, or six. Uh, okay. Interesting. And what time do you finish, Moises? Um, no regular. No es, hay horario a veces 3 p.m. o or, or 7, 8 p.m. No. Ah, really? Uh, I, am, I am working the, 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 the farm. Uh, I understand. Travel, travel, travel the farm. Uh, and, I understand. Uh, It's complicated, right? It's complicated, yeah. yes. I understand. Okay. Now, class, let's continue. Thank you, Moises. Thank you. Now, let's continue. Okay. Regular activities at the workplace, right? We have here a conversation and we're going to practice. Yes. He says, what's your name? And he says, my name is Toñito, Toño, right, Antonio. Where do you live? I live in Rome. 
What language do you speak? I speak Italian. Tell me, what do you do every day? I eat Italian food. I sing Italian songs. And I watch Italian TV shows. Okay. La ragazza mangiare il gelato e mangiare la pizza in la, in la sua Italia. <laughs> yes. So please, class, repeat after me. Repeat after me. Repetition. Ready? Come on. What's your name? My name is Antonio. Where do you live? I live in Rome. What language do you speak? Language. What language do you speak? I speak Italian. Italian. Tell me, what do you do every day? I eat Italian food. I sing Italian songs. And I watch Italian TV shows. Okay? Good. Now we're going to practice this conversation. Make it this question. Look, what's your name? Where do you live? What language do you speak? And what do you do every day? Right? Let's talk about Carmen, right? So, what's your name? Mm, my name is Carmen. Se me perdió la cadenita. <laughs> no, sorry. My name is Carmen. Where do you live? I live in... Madrid. Madrid, correct. What language do you speak? Spanish. I speak Spanish, correct. What do you do every day? I eat. I eat Spanish food. Food. I sing Spanish songs and I watch. Uh, Spanish TV show. And... Excelentoso. Thank you very much, right? Now, I'm, I'm going to have a Alexi and William, right? Alexi, your letter A. ¿Usted va a hacer las preguntas, Alexi? Thank you, sir. And William, you make the answer, right? About Carmen. Are you ready, boys? One, two, three, action. What your name? My name is Antonio. No, no, Carmen, Carmen. We're going to use Carmen. Oh. Excuse me, excuse me, William. My name is Carmen. Excellent. Alexi, continue. Where do you, la where do you live? Where do you? Where do you? No, no, where do you? Where do you? Live. Live. I live in Madrid. What language do you speak? Mm -hmm. I speak Spanish. Excellent. What do you do every day? day? I eat Spanish food. I sing Spanish song and I watch Spanish TV show. Excellent. Also, right? Nice. Okay, let's continue with the next one. We're going to talk about Kinji. Kinji, right? So, Wilmer, please. You and Brenda Lee. Wilmer, you make the questions. And Brenda Lee make the answer, right? About, Ken no, no, we're going to make the opposite because Kenji is a boy, right? So, Brenda Lee, you make the questions. 
right? And Wilmer makes the answer, right? Are you ready? Ladies and gentlemen, directly from Hollywood, California, tonight we have Wilmer and Brenda Lee. Action. What is your name? My name is Antonio. No, no, no. My name is Kenji. Look. Kenji. Oh, come on. Repeat. My name, my... Is... My name is Kenji. Where do you live? I live in Tokyo. What language do you speak? I speak Japanese. Tell me what do you every day? Mm, I eat Japanese food and uh, sing Japanese songs and watch uh, Japanese TV shows. Okie dokie, thank you. Excellent participation, right? Okay, and to finish, let's go to the last, right? Oh, no veo toda la presentación, dice William. Eh, permítame, voy a dejar de compartir, William. Y luego comparto nuevamente. Ok, vamos a ver. Permítame, aquí hay un micrófono ahí. Cepillador. Permítame. Ahí estamos. Good. Ok. William, hoy sí puede ver la pantalla. Yes. Yes, yes. Ok, sorry. Eh, William, es que fíjense que hay un error en, en el Zoom. A veces cuando uno está presentando el PowerPoint se queda como, como congelada la pantalla anterior, ¿verdad? Así que ahí va a disculpar. Now, let's go to the to Nicole. Let's talk about Nicole. Y luego terminamos. What time is it? Vamos a ver qué, qué hora es. No, no, se nos fue el tiempo. Ok, ya estaba ya entusiasmado. Very good. Eh, nos faltó incluso un material que les tengo ahí, chicos, en un libro virtual, así que está bien bonito, les va a gustar, pero para mañana, tomorrow, right? Tomorrow. Today, that, that, that's all, folks. Solo voy a pasar el listado. Eh, Brenda, ¿se puede quedar conmigo 10 minutos? Brenda Lee, perdón. Brenda Lee. Sí, teacher. Yes, excelentoso. Ok, asistencia, Brenda Lee, ok. Brenda. Brenda, say present. Present. Okay, have a good night. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Carlos? Fra Francisco? Third teacher, present. Thank you. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Delia? Present. present. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. God bless you. Elsa? Good night. Good night. Erenia. Evelyn. Good night. Good night. God bless you. Freddy. Oh, no, Freddy. It's not, uh, Ingrid. Present teacher. Thank you. See you tomorrow, Ingrid. Uh, Jessica Carolina. Thank, thank you. Present teacher, feliz noche. Okay, happy week, happy weekend. No? Have a good night. Yes. Thank Have you. a good night. Yes. Okay. Now, uh, Kenya. Maria. Present. Thank you, Maria Rene. Present. Thank you. See you tomorrow, Maria Rene. Mateo? Present. Ok, see you tomorrow, Mateo. Bye. Muy, 
Okay. Moisés. Uh, present teacher. Okay. Bye bye. Take care. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow, teacher. Bye bye. Uh, Alexi. Present teacher. Okay. See you tomorrow, Alexi, and welcome to the class. Uh, Thank William, you. you're welcome. William Antonio. Good night. Good night. God bless you. Thank you. Wilmer. Present teacher. Okay. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Okay. Uh, Carlos Armando. Carlos. Directly from San Miguel, Carlos Armando. No. Kenya. Bueno. Present teacher. Okay. Bye bye. See you tomorrow, Kenya. Bye, bye, bye. Okay. Carlos Armando me copia. Mr. Carpio Abarca. Okay, bueno. Vamos a dejar ahí a Carlos. Brenda Lee. Eh, puede, puede encender su micrófono, Brenda Lee. Sí. No, no, perdón, se, no, la cámara. <ríe> ya estaba ah, encendido. Eh. Ah. No, no, no puede. Fíjate que sí, ahorita sí, quizás no puedo. Ah, ok. Pero prometo no, que no. para mañana sí. sí la ok. Voy a no problem. <ríe> Brenda Lee, ¿any question about the class? Sí, eso que gracias a Dios. Le logré entender a todo, la mayoría. Solo okay. que sí, quizás se me hace un poquito difícil lo que es entender, eh, escuchar, ya cuando el listening. Listen, oh. Sí, sí, el listening, sí. Pero cuando yo Ajá, hablo, ¿sí? cuando yo hablo, ¿me entiende, Brenda Lee? Sí, sí. Ah, sí okay. cuando usted, a veces, a veces, oh. a veces. Ah. <risa> no me aplica, hay ocasiones ¿verdad? que sí me quedo hay ocasiones en que sí me quedo como ¿qué, qué dijo? pero no, no, pero, but you can, pero puede yo. Brenda Lee, pero puede tenerme dígame, teacher, can you repeat, please y yo le repito okay, las veces okay. que usted me quiera yo estoy, sir, yo yes, sir 24-7 <risa> sí a la hora pero el tema, de los temas que quizás hemos tocado sí Sí, Pero, he comprendido. Bueno, este tema lo vimos en el curso anterior, ¿verdad, Brenda Lee? Sí. Sí, va. Sí. Mira, entonces, este es un refuerzo. Sí. Y falta... Sí, un refuerzo. Fíjese que le voy, a, le voy a presentar un libro. Bueno, ya sabe cuál es. Déjeme ver aquí. Se lo voy a enseñar. Ah, no lo veo aquí. Es que tengo muchas cosas abiertas. Por aquí es. Bueno, pero es un libro que siempre les muestro ahí, ¿verdad? Con audio. Ajá. Tiene ejercicio. Eso me ayuda un montón. Me sí. ayuda un gran montón. O sea, trato de poner atención y de ver si logro entender. Sí. Y, y mire, sí me ayuda un gran montón. los videos que yo mando los, los logra abrir y, y practicar con ellos. Hay algunos que sí, otros que sí no, no los he logrado ver por, por factor tiempo. Sí. Pero eh, mientras puedo, sí. Vaya, pero le voy, a, le voy a recomendar que al menos, porque usted dice que le, le gusta lo de practicar lo de listening, al menos los días ¿Sí? miércoles, los miércoles mando un ejercicio de, de escuchar. Es, Ajá, un, ¿sí? es un examen de niños, ¿verdad? Pero ahí le pone la imagen y le dice, mire, este niño está haciendo esto o lo otro. Entonces ahí usted distingue y, y responde. ¿sí? También seguí el consejo que me dio la vez pasada de ver este, escuchar música oh, de serie excelente. casi no les entiendo pero yo digo que en algún momento no, no, lo pero es que mire, no, no es cierto Brenda Lee, fíjese que esto es un proceso, ¿verdad? como nosotros los adultos nos cuesta sí. más a los niños, así, ¿verdad? aprenden los, los sonidos sí. pero nosotros como ya, ya identificamos los sonidos que usamos en español nos cuesta entender los de inglés pero ahí va escuchando usted mire, si usted sí. escucha una canción o ve una película, si usted entiende el 5%, ya hay ganancia. Es peor que Así cero. Es. es peor que no entendía ni una palabra, ¿verdad? Sí. En, 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 como yo le dije la vez pasada, le recomiendo muñequitos. Sí, porque... Hablan... Sí, me ha animado más por, por series que ya he visto en español. 
Y las estoy viendo en inglés, inglés. pero no sé. Porque más o menos ubica en qué, qué dijeron o cómo hablan, Ajá, ¿verdad? exacto. Mire, ¿y a usted no le ha pasado que cuando está escuchando inglés se oye mejor o se oye diferente de cómo se escucha en español, verdad? Sí. Es porque usan las voces originales. Imagínense qué feo Sí, que uno... me imagino que por eso. Sí, se oye más natural. Hay una película de Brenda Lee que se llama eh, Forrest Gump. Es una de mis favoritas. No Ah, sé si... sí, me encanta. Bueno, es mi es uno de los actores que más admiro. No, yo también. Eh, Él. Tom, eh, ¿Cómo se llama? Tom Tom Hanks. Hanks. Tom Hanks. Tom Otro, Hanks, o, sí. otro actor que es buenísimo es Javier Gómez. Es buen actor, sí. <risa> ok. Entonces, esa película... Ah. <risa> y este de dónde salió? <ríe> Mentira. <ríe> broma, Ok, eh, chichero, broma. vaya, Brendale, mire, eh, eh, en el caso de Forrest Gump, fíjese que yo la he escuchado en español, horrible, o sea, dice, me llamo Forrest, Forrest Gump, ok, pero si Ajá. usted lo escucha en inglés, my name's Forrest, Forrest Gump, más natural, Súper ¿verdad? diferente. súper Sí. diferente, súper mejor, <risa> ¿verdad? Y los jueves, Brenda Lee les mando un video de, de una canción. Ok. La semana pasada, como seguíamos en el grupo, ¿se acuerda? Usted estaba en el grupo anterior, ¿verdad? Sí, De, sí. terminó el curso, pero yo no le dije a que al grupo, yo seguí mandándoles. No, ahí está bien. De hecho, me Sí. puse a ver algunos ahí de los que mandó. sí, ¿cuál canción puse el jueves pasado? A ver si se acuerda. <risa> Mm, yeah. <ríe> Fíjate que como yo no escucho secular realmente, escucho más que toda la danza, casi no me puedo los no, no, nombres. No. Ah, pero, pero religiosamente no hay problema que escuche canciones en inglés. No, no, Ah. solo que no me las puedo, por lo tanto no, no es, es fácil recordar. Sí, porque eh, tengo una compañía en el trabajo que dice que no, no puede escuchar cualquier tipo de música. Entonces entiendo yo que a veces por la cuestión de religión es un poquito complicado, ¿verdad? Pero gracias a Dios usted sí puede, ¿no? Este, O la sea, can... sí es esa frente. Sí, como le dije, les dije yo en el grupo, Jesús, Jesús Adrián es, ¿verdad? Sí, se fue del primero. La voz de ese, de ese señor es buenísima, así que va. la canción que les puse se llama She Will Be Love. She will be loved. Love, ¿sí? ¿Sabe cuál es? No. Vaya, voy a intentar ponérsela en el... En el... En el celular, pero fíjese que no me está cargando. Lo voy, a, lo voy a poner en YouTube solo para que escuche el sonido y vea que es bien fácil cantarla. Ahí está, ya me la sacó. Aquí se la pongo en el micrófono. Ya la he escuchado. Sí, esa es bien bonita. Vaya, y la tienen en el grupo. Bueno, en el anterior creo que no lo, no lo han cerrado Ajá. todavía. No, todavía no. Ah, pues ahí escuche la canción esa. ¿Verdad? Y, Sí, y, y este tarea jueves... cantarla. Ah. Aprenderse, no, no, Brenda Lee, es que se las tiene que aprender. O sea, usted vea la letra y después solo escuche la música y vaya repitiendo. No, hombre, Okay. eso le va a ayudar, no se imagina. Yo así aprendí inglés, aprendiéndome las Sí. canciones. Así aprendí inglés yo. Ya que a mí, a mí me gusta bastante la música, así que he optado por ese método. O sea, Por favor. siento que me va. Uh -huh. Sí, sí, inténtelo porque... Este, aparte que a uno le gusta, sabe que la música, no sé si a usted le ha pasado que de repente anda haciendo, lavando algo, o está en su trabajo, y de repente le cae una canción y usted Ando empieza cantando. a, a, a cantarla así de la nada, ¿va? Sí. Es porque en su memoria ya está bien grabada la canción. Entonces, lo mismo Es sucede cierto. con las canciones en inglés. De repente usted empieza a decir... Eh, Uh, making love out of nothing at all. Making love. <risa> y empieza a cantar la canción en inglés. Entonces eso le ayuda a, a producir 
inglés, ¿verdad? Así Vocabulario que, también. Sí, correcto. Ok, Brenda Lee, I don't know if, if you have any question. No sé si tiene alguna otra pregunta. No. No, no. Thank you, teacher. Fíjense que si usted se quiere reenganchar por ahí cuando estemos los últimos días de clase, pues, eh, y hay algún compañero que, que no quiera, pues ahí usted puede incluirse nuevamente. Ahí estamos siempre a la orden. Oiga. Ay, está bien. Ok. Muchas have a gracias. good night. And see you tomorrow. Thank you, teacher. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Bye.